Hey everybody, Stephen and Kara. We just spent four days at Huntsville State Park in Huntsville, Texas, and um, it was good. Um, the park is great. This is our first time we've been at this park. Um, it's nice. It's. <laughs> on was it lake raven lake raven and uh you can kayak you can rent paddle boats you can fish um they have a designated swimming area because there's alligators i wouldn't swim but they say don't feed the alligators but yet they say you can go swimming anyway uh people swim and they seem to have fun mm -hmm. shelters where it's you know just the glorified tent mm -hmm. and it's just a a screened in shelter and i think they provide a table and there might be electricity in there i think there is mm -hmm. but you bring your own bedding and everything and then the, where the loop we're on is uh, full hookups power water sewer mm -hmm. um probably 30 spots uh, with full uh, full hookups. Yeah. They do have bathrooms just right at the end of the street. It's a nice park. Um, so definitely if you're in the southeast Texas, north of Houston area, you should come definitely check it out. And uh, we did get out and do some things in Huntsville over the weekend. Um, we went to this really neat restaurant. Uh, it's called... Uh, City Hall Cafe and Pie Bar. Yeah. They had me at Pie Bar. <laughs> and so we went there uh, Friday afternoon and we had lunch. And it was really good. The food was excellent. And service was good. The service was good. And, you, you know, you have to wear your mask. The pie was great. And so if you're in Huntsville, go to City Hall Cafe and Pie Bar. It's excellent. We also went to the prison, prison museum mm -hmm. because in Huntsville, of course, is um, the maximum security prison in Texas. It's got a lot of history to about the prison. It's really a good, you know, hour or two uh, out of your day if you want to, you know, really look around. It has a really neat um, displays. So go if you're ever in Huntsville. The entrance yeah. fee to the prison museum was seven dollars a person. Yeah. And of course, it goes to support the museum, which is you know it's worth it. Because and right next to it, we didn't go, but right next to it is the Veterans Museum. So you could easily kill two birds with one stone right there. Yeah. Uh, hit one, then walk right across the parking lot to the other one. We went over to the Sam Houston statue. Oh uh, yeah. In, uh, just He's 77 feet tall. 77 feet tall. Um, I think the Statue of Liberty is 130. Oh, it's 111 feet. 111 tall. feet tall. So just some reference into how big he is. Uh, but it's a really neat place uh, to just come see, take some photographs. They do have a store. Uh, a museum. It, all that was closed. We were there this morning before they opened. Um, but that's definitely something to check out when you're in Huntsville also. Yeah, Sam Houston um, is the father of Texas. He, he was the general during the Texas Revolution, and um, so he's pretty important to our state. You know, we did a lot of good cooking while we were uh, camping this weekend. Mm. Uh, we cooked pizza in the Dutch oven. Uh, Cowboy breakfast. 
Cowboy yesterday Burgers. Yesterday morning, which was really good. Mm -hmm. I'm going to add salt and pepper to it. Salt. And it's just the little mini graham cracker pie crust things. Mm -hmm. And you put your chocolate in there. Then you put the marshmallow on top of it. We put ours in the Dutch oven. They cooked for probably two or three minutes. Yeah. And they were no more, No more than three minutes. Yeah. The marsh marshmallows were toasted. And the chocolate was melty. And it was delicious. So anyway, look, we had a great weekend. Definitely, if you're passing through Huntsville or you're looking for a state park to hit, Huntsville is a good state park uh, yeah. to try out. One of the things that we did today, um, mm. today's Sunday, mm. so of course it's the end of the weekend, and so we watched everybody leave, mm -hmm. and then a couple of hours later we watched all the new people come in and fill up the the spots yeah. so so we got our people watching fix in and that was fun watching everybody set up and tear down and it was a good time yeah it was fun <laughs> oh one more thing since this was the fourth of july weekend we last night saturday we were going to go watch the fireworks in huntsville so we were trying to leave the park but they closed the park at 7 45 they shut the gate you can't get out and if you're out, we don't know if we could have gotten back in. So they had some big, big steel barricades closed yeah. over the road. Um, so I don't know. That's good to know, though. You know, if uh, yeah. was it just for this weekend? I don't know. Maybe because of the. You know, you know. we're still new to all this, and uh, definitely state parks. We've been to a bunch of state parks, but we've never tried to leave after dark. Um, yeah. So this is our first time attempting to leave, and we didn't leave. We just turned and came back and spent the 4th of July sitting under the awning. But, which is fine, yeah. which is what we do best anyway. So. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, look, appreciate you watching our video. If you stumbled across us, this is your first time, please subscribe to our channel. Give us a thumbs up. Uh, we try to release videos every week, RV-related, cooking, gardening, something. We're releasing some kind of video. So appreciate your time and we'll see you later.